went into limbo. <laughs> <laughs> Just a normal thing. It's like, you know, you get it with new cars. <laughs> Cheyenne, uh, stop back there because his car went in the lip mode. You said it happens with new cars, though, so they are over it now. Are you ready to go? Yeah, yeah. let's do it. Are yeah. you filming or am I filming? I don't know who's filming. Who's filming? <laughs> oh! Oh, my God, dude. That is crazy. Hey. Hey, we got 30 points. We paid 30 points. We found the elf. Today I'm with my boy Sean. Hello. We are at Strada Exotic in Phoenix, Arizona. We're running around with 30 exotics today doing a scavenger hunt across all of Arizona. So a little background on Sean, he's my best friend. I moved here from, moved to Florida from Arizona and how we got in touch was, I went to dental school with Spicy Spence's older brother, Brett. So if you guys ever seen Spicy Spence, he does all the announcing at Cletus and Cars. And other events and then brett and i used to come to arizona to party and stuff while we we're in dental school and that's how we got in touch with sean right yeah we had mutual friends and a few few drinks in between there a few <laughs> drinks in between there and then spicy spence you know we introduced him to my brother and then he ended up moving to florida to do stuff with him so that's how that whole circle comes together but today's going to be pretty epic because it's all points based system that we have a list of checkpoints and each one is like five points 20 points 10 points and you accumulate all these points throughout the day, winner gets a thousand bucks. So yeah. it's really more for the fun of the drive and uh, have seen all these other cool cars out here like Ferraris, McLarens, Lambos, you name it, it's gonna be here. I think Cheyenne's gonna be here in his Tesla Plaid. So it's gonna be an epic day. It's a little bit of different content for you guys. <laughs> so come follow along. Whoa, 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 <laughs> what, your windows don't roll down? <laughs> Barely. Barely. We don't want to try because it might not go back up. Dude, this thing is so sketch. Dude, you're still leaking water. Oh, uh, yeah. It's, <laughs> it's still know, every time I dig into a car wash, it has post traumatic stress. And like, <laughs> the AC shuts off. It's like, no, I don't want to do it. Glad you came out. I'm excited, buddy. I'm glad you're out here. Me too. Good to see you. Good Going to see on. you, man. Good finally. You. Right? It took Parker coming yeah. out for us to finally roll. Seriously, it seriously. What do you got? I guess it's like part of the hunt. Gotcha. Oh, uh, this is our scavenger Apparently, hunt? Yep. Allegedly. Okay, so we get points for each one we take a picture with. Is that right? Yes. Yeah, so you need to take that with you. Just cross it off. Uh, okay. Is that correct, though? Thank you. If you're not smiling, deduct the three points. So we need to take a picture next to each one of these to get the points correlated with it throughout the day. Honey bee sign, floating gold star. Okay. Sweet. Scary pumpkin head balloon. A scary pumpkin head balloon. <laughs> oh, I like okay. it. Hey, I'm gonna send you guys a picture of all the stuff you're looking for, so you're not completely blind. Okay. All right. All right. Show us your trusty steed. What are we driving in today? So we have a 2017 Lamborghini Huracan. Ooh. Triple black. Is that LP 580? Yep. Triple black. So clean. Completely stock aside from the suspension. I lowered it. And window tint. And window tint. So you can't see. I mean, this is legitimately probably one of the cleanest Lambos I've seen. Normally they get a little dense and scratch all over them, but not this one. This thing is dialed. Might get so. a few rock chips today, but it's worth it. Yeah, you know, that's If we're first, we won't get it. any rock chips. So yeah, and then we'll just first. spend the money. Yeah, if we're ahead of everybody, no rock chips. And then if we do, we can spend a thousand bucks to get it. Yeah, easy, but easy. No problem. <laughs> Ooh, Huracan STO. If you notice this front uh, body is all one piece. Yeah, the whole thing clips and comes forward. Yeah? yeah. Oh, like it rotates forward yeah, like this? Yeah, it rotates forward. It's on front hinge. It's pretty <laughs> sick. So somebody's going to be driving this thing today. Yeah. Ventador, Ventador, Ferrari, Ferrari. All kinds of goodies. Got two McLarens, F12, <clears throat> another Ferrari. I just have the biggest heart for F12s. They just sound so sick and they're so fast. Wait till you hear this one. He's got this straight pipe. Really? Yeah, it's their straight pipe. There's some exhaust on it. Would it sound good? Nice. V12 FFS. Oh, they all got radios? Yeah, we have a radio. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Nice. Nice, dude. 488 Pista. 
I think the Pista has this big air dam in the front. Yeah. Like not all 488s have that. I could be wrong. I do believe it's correct. I'm more of a Lamborghini guy, so I don't know too much about. You said that's an but... SVJ. Uh, yeah, so we have the Venador um, SVJ. What is the SVJ? More Trim aero package, package and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah more aero. I'm not totally sure on the details. NSX, but... shout out, pretty sick. Yeah, some guy bring, always brings a Honda. <laughs> <laughs> Honda guys, yeah, somebody's yeah. got to do it. <laughs> Stop back there because his car went into lip mode. He said it happens with new cars though, so they are over it now. Are you ready to go? Yeah, let's do it. Are yeah. you filming or am I filming? I don't know who's filming. Who's filming? Oh! Oh my god, dude! That is crazy. Dude, he was gone. Oh my god! He got me. We just, we just got school bus. <laughs> Freight train. Length on there. Freight yeah. train by the plaid. Okay, one of our first mile uh, checkpoints is this mile marker 205. It's going to be coming up pretty quick here. There she is. Five points on the board. And we're going to be here. Made it to the first checkpoint. You know what it smells like? Smells like brakes. <laughs> smells like brakes out here. <laughs> okay, checkpoint number one, tracked red tractor on the left side of the road. Got it. Okay, and then now what do we got? We got a uh, watch out for moose sign. Okay, watch out for moose sign, but it's really elk. There's no <laughs> moose yeah. running around here in Arizona. Uh, that was a bit of a typo, I hope. Oh, look at that dog. Here we go, no, more points on the board. Elk sign. Oh my God. We made it to the Flagstaff. It's the end of our second checkpoint. Yeah, halfway through. How are we looking points wise? We've missed a, we've missed a couple. Yeah, we've missed three, but I think one of them actually popped. We're supposed to find a balloon on the side of the road. There was no balloon. There's no balloon. We uh, lugged. So but we we're also, we we're all also hauling the mail. What was it? I didn't see a balloon. Because you're driving fast. <laughs> I don't know. We were going slow. We're sitting at about 35 points out of the possible. We're missing out on about 30 more. Yeah, but I know some people missed a bunch of that stuff, like the yeah. Halloween guy. We got to see an elk because that's like a bonus 30. Yeah, so we got to find someone to find an elk. So we're in Flagstaff on the end of Section 2. We're having lunch, yeah. and then we're going to go to Cottonwood after this. Yep, Cottonwood, and go from there. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Sean, on the sheet it says any moose or elk, or elk okay. on the trip. And here's our elk. Doesn't oh, mean... here's Chet coming by. <laughs> here's Chet. Yeah. It doesn't have to be alive, but there it is. There's our elk. Found it. That's 30 points. That is 30 points. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey, we got 30 points. We found 30 points. We found the elk. <laughs> <laughs> we should do uh we should put a get well soon balloon on it <laughs> if we had a balloon oh my god Peta loves me already it doesn't say it has to be alive john we only got uh 22 of the 47 points on that one really we only got 22 of the 47 yeah, points. Yeah, that was not our best round, but we did. We did get the 30. Extras. We did get the 30. It's a deer. I saw it as I drove by. It's not an elk. Hunter, per, you, didn't you write? Didn't you say the moose sign? Any, yeah, any moose there's or no, elk. There's no moose in Arizona. I know, I understand that. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. There's also no picture of the of the freaking the red tractor with the scarecrow. 
Was that was that made up? No, that's there. Is it? Yeah, it's, it's a scavenger hunt. Oh. Not, not a scavenger. Oh, by the way, here's every clue. Just <laughs> it's not a. Oh, you can't see it when we're going 80 miles an hour. All right. Every so single is, one of them. See this pumpkin patch sign? Saw that. It's yeah. 50 feet past that. Oh god. Oh. If you took a picture of this. You might have gotten we a picture of that. We might have gotten it. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Video picture, so. Okay. Yeah, so you might have it. I might have it. But we'll take a look. All right. We'll have to do some editing. Right. We did miss the uh, Indian jewelry store statue. And we missed 4,000. Well, we saw it. Yeah, we saw it, but we right. did not. <laughs> yeah. well, it's funny because it's out of, at, like in the middle of nowhere. You're like, oh, this fuck there it is. I was yeah, watching but... Four Flight, like the app for flying, right. and watching our elevation, and then I was like, all right, I'm going to. Close my eyes for a second, <laughs> and then I close missed his, it. Close his eyes for a second. There it goes. All right, so there's so two points. It's a scavenger hunt with some easy gimmies like mile marker 269 or 205. Yep. yep. But I can't be, you know, I can't yeah. draw a road map on every little thing. <laughs> right, right. Right. I'm still taking that 30 points. Who do you think's having more fun, it's us or these guys in the razors? I don't you know. know. We got some good said, units that over there. That should be our next rally. Yeah, that all razors sick. or side by sides. So I'm gonna do one um, in the spring. We're leaving here. We're going all the back roads up through Monument Valley and then all the way up into Moab. We're nice. going to do Moab. We're going to do those for a day and then we're going to leave Moab and go through the canyons, which are essentially like 69A up there. Yeah. But it's all through Moab for about eight hours of that. Jesus. And head down to south, south Utah. Then we'll do a Vegas and come north rim and come home. It'll be like a three day deal. Oh, that would be heck, legendary. Yeah. All right, so uh, Sean, he owns the Steimer team, mm -hmm. big realty group in Arizona. You and your dad, you guys did how much in sales last year? Uh, we, me and my dad, my sister did about 63 million. Just Six them million. three, not like a group of people. I mean, they are the one of the top, the top producers. Yeah, number two in all of Arizona. Number two in all of Arizona. How yeah. incredible is that? So whether it's something small, big, he does it all. Give them a subscribe, like, follow. I'll put the other info in the description below if you guys ever need a house in Arizona. Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> <laughs> Ready? Um, One, two, three. Oh, dude. All right, so we ended up with what? 109, 109 like 160 ish. Yeah. So we already know some people got ahead of us. Yeah. So we're definitely not going to get the thousand bucks, but. We didn't what? come last. We didn't come last. So I'll, I'll take that. That's and we one. found an elk. <laughs> and we found an elk. We saw a whole bunch of shit people missed, so I'm, I'm pumped about that. Right, so, right. It was so, fun. Yeah, was it was fun. Cool experience for sure. We got to yeah. do it next yeah. year. I don't know. How long were we in the car for? Well, what? Well, we left at 8 got back at five so nine hours but we stopped for lunch stuff like that back is a little stiff but back is a little stiff <laughs> all right we're gonna get into a little bit of dental content but before we do that make sure you guys subscribe like leave me a comment because we got to do teeth and turbos <laughs> okay teeth and turbos this is a little portion of the teeth going on here Traditionally, dental implants are placed into the bone for those that are missing teeth into something like this. Now, not everybody has enough bone to place traditional dental implants. So this particular course is about zygomatic implants, and zygomatic implants are placed into the zygomatic bone or your cheekbone that stretch all the way through or through the mouth and come down inside of the mouth and allow you to attach something like a denture to or teeth so that you can eat comfortably. How these implants are placed they come through the jaw on the tongue side, on the palate. They come up and implant into the cheekbone. Okay, so I've prepared the site and I'm going to actually place the implant. Here's two different examples of zygomatics that are placed. One would be internal where it actually passes through the inside of the sinus. Uh, and this would be an external one because there's different shapes to people's faces, right? So sometimes it's a little more concave, sometimes a little more convex or straight. So we're practicing two different methods, having the implant on the outside of the sinus or on the inside of the sinus or somewhat passing through to make sure we get that strong anchor into the uh, cheekbone to secure a denture teeth to the implants. 